Hi friends, I am Subhaprata Bosu. Today is a very special day because today is the date 18th May and on this date the great British philosopher as well as Nobel laureate, you all know the name, Bertrand Russell was born. So, today's, in today's video, I shall try to discuss some basic concepts and philosophy of Barton Russell and also I will try to discuss his life and works to pay homage to the great philosopher. Let's start. Barton Arthur William Russell, he was the third Earl Russell, was born on 18th May 1872 and he died on 2nd February 1970. He was a British philosopher, logician, mathematician, historian, writer, essayist, social critic, political activist, and Nobel laureate, and what not. He was born in Monmouthshire into one of the most prominent aristocratic families in the United Kingdom. He died at the age of 97. He lived a very long years. He was awarded Nobel, Lit Nobel Prize in Literature in 1950. In the early 20th century, Russell led the British revolt against idealism. And what is idealism? British idealism was generally marked by several broad tendencies, a belief in an absolute, a single all-encompassing reality that in some sense formed a coherent and all-inclusive system. And the assignment of a high place to reason as both the faculty by which the absolute structure is grasped and as that structure itself and a fundamental unwillingness to accept a dichotomy between thought and object, reality consisting of thought and object together in a strongly coherent unity. British idealism was largely developed from the German idealist movement, especially by Immanuel Kant and G. W. F. Hegel. Russell is considered one of the founders of analytic philosophy too. Analytic philosophy is a branch of tradition of philosophy using analysis which is popular in the Western world and Anglosphere beginning around the turn of the 20th century in the contemporary era and continues today. It is based on conceptual clarity against Hegelianism uh, being obscure. Being obscure. Unlike the theory of idealism which tries to establish the relation between items and the whole world with internal relations that is the properties of the nature of those items, Russell promulgated logical atomism and the doctrine of external relations, the belief that the world consists of independent facts. He is widely held to be one of the 20th century's premier logicians. With A. N. Whitehead, he wrote Principia Mathematica, an attempt to create a logical basis for mathematics, the quintessential work of classical logic. His philosophical essay on denoting has been considered a paradigm of philosophy. His works has had a considerable influence on mathematics, logic, set theory, linguistics, artificial intelligence, cognitive science, computer science and philosophy, especially the philosophy of language, epistemology and metaphysics. A short biographical background of Barton Russell. Russell was born into an influential and liberal family of the British aristocracy. His parents were Viscount and Viscountess. Amberley, his parental grandfather, the Earl Russell, had been asked twice by Queen Victoria to form a government, serving her as Prime Minister in the 1840s and 1860s. Russell had two siblings, brother Frank and sister Russell. His mother and father died of diphtheria and bronchitis respectively, and his sister too, Frank and Bertrand, are placed in the care of the paternal grandparents. Russell's adolescence was very lonely. He often contemplated suicide, but he did not, only for the knowledge of mathematics and his desire to know more mathematics. 
in his autobiography he honestly said that nature and books and later mathematics saved me from complete despondency only to wish to know more mathematics when russell was 11 years old his brother frank introduced him to the work of euclid which he described in his autobiography as one of the great events of my life as dazzling as first love he was also a great admirer of the poetry of parsi b c selly about parsi b c selly he wrote i am quoting his word i spent all my spare time reading him and learning him by heart knowing no one to whom i could speak of what i thought or felt i used to reflect how wonderful it would have been to know selly and to wonder whether i should meet any live human being with whom i should feel so much sympathy so i have learned that and you too that he was a great devotee of the poetry of parsi b c selly and his philosophy too russell won a scholarship to read for mathematical tripod at trinity college cambridge i am trying to give some of his personal experiences and some of his personal life with you he fell in love with alice married her on 30th december 13th december 1894 but suddenly while cycling he felt that he did not love her so what a great and strange amazement of his life later he married dora and also his third marriage to patricia spain now i'll try to discuss some of his major works of russell there are many works written by russell many essays many articles many books i will here share some of his most important works by russell russell was the author of more than 60 books and over 2000 articles in 1996 he wrote the first book german social democracy in 19 1897 he wrote an essay on the foundations of geometry we all know that he was not only a great philosopher but also a great mathematician too in 1903 he wrote the principles of mathematics in 1912 the problems of philosophy in 1916 why men fly in 1922 free thought and official propaganda in 1923 human knowledge its scope and limits in 1925 the abc of relativity in 1925 again his another book what i believe in 1927 an outline of philosophy and why i am not a christian a most important and major works of russell in 1927 selected papers of barton russell in 1928 skeptical essays in 1929 marriage and morals in 1930 the conquest of happiness in 1931 the scientific outlook in 1932 education and the social order in 1934 freedom and organization in 1935 in praise of idleness and other essays in 1935 religion and science in 1938 power a new social analysis in 1945 a history of western philosophy in 1959 my philosophical development in 1951 to 69 one of his great and most important work was the autobiography of barton russell so this is the video for today i have tried to pay homage to the great philosopher on his birth anniversary if you like my video and want to get more please subscribe and share my channel Thank you.